this video, we'll show how to make a funny paper tube bicycle flower pot holder for the kids' room. Lay your protecting cover. Make magazine page tubes. Fold the page in half. Cut out with a craft knife. Add white glue across the edge. Roll the paper on the needle, starting with the corner. Make a couple of dozens of these tubes. Weave four tubes to shape a square in the center. It will be a frame. Make an extended weaving tube. Fold the end of a tube in half. Add some glue. Put it into another tube. Bend the long one in half. Wrap around a frame tube or stand as we'll call it further on. Weave around another stand. Continue in the same way. Extend the tubes as far as needed. Finish weaving after the fourth row. Fasten the tube ends using glue. Bend the stand to the right, winding around the next one. Cut off the excess. Glue the end. Tuck back inside the weaving. Continue in the same way. We've got a wheel. Make two more of the same wheels. Now, we should weave a pot. Make six extended frame stands. Place them crisscrossing per every three ones. Make another long weaving tube. Bend it in half. Start weaving around the three stands together first. Separate one stand from the three after the second row to weave it individually. Divide the stand pairs in the next row to weave each tube separately. Continue further without changes. See how the weaving fits the flower pot? The size is fitting well. We can complete the bottom. Wind a stand around the next right one and bend upright. Repeat for the rest of the stands. The last one passes through the loop made with the first stand. Weave around the vertical stands. Be careful to increase the diameter upwards to follow the flower pot shape. Put in the flower pot to see if the height is enough. It is appropriate. You can finish weaving. Bend the stands to complete the edge in the same way you did when making the wheels. The woven flower pot is ready. We can make a bicycle. Pass the folded in half tube into the center of the wheel to make a shaft. Put the pot on the shaft to measure the appropriate space between the wheels. Fasten the ends. Wind four bended long tubes around the shaft to create a bicycle frame. Weave around the two pairs from the left to the right direction.
When the row is finished, turn back and continue weaving. Upon completion of the fifth row, cut off one of the edge stands on both sides. Continue weaving. Press over the stands from the sides to narrow the frame. Weave three stands at a time for several rows. Cut off two more stands. Put the wheel between the stands. Mark the shaft set place. Bend two stands back to make a loop. Fasten it with eight shaped lines. Cut off the excess end. Glue it. Cut off the excess. Repeat for the other side. Make a handlebar. Wind two tubes around the third one. Glue another tube end to the top of the handlebar. Weave around the pair stands with eight shaped winds. When the handlebar is of the appropriate height, glue the tube end. Assemble the bicycle. Cut off the two long handlebar tubes. Bend the two bottom tubes to the right. Pass them through the loop. Repeat for the other side. Bend the ends down and glue. Make the same on the other side. Put the shaft into the front wheel, passing through the loops. Bend and tuck the ends into the wheel. Repeat for the other side. Cut off the ends. Attach the woven pot to the bicycle using a hot glue gun. Apply a dark lacquer finishing coat with a brush. Let it dry. Let's take a look. Cool! The craft is ready. Plant your favorite flower in the pot and decorate the windowsill with an amusing bicycle flower pot holder or put a toy in it. Your kids will enjoy it. Leave your comments. Join us on social links. Subscribe to our channel to see lots of new home decoration ideas.